National Park Nighthawks basketball is on X Hero Sports, the next generation of Arkansas sports. Our Nighthawk takeover for today's game, Miss Bailey Womack. Bailey, the past two years have just flown by in Nighthawk Blue. Uh, you didn't have to go very far to continue your basketball career, which was nice. But you know, tell us a little bit about your journey these past two years, really laying the groundwork for the women's program and, and helping female athletes here in Garland County have a close second place to play the, the sport that they love. Well, this is definitely the sport that I love, so I'm glad that I can stay in my hometown and be in my community and see all these people that come around. Like I said last time, there's a bunch of girls that we played against high school. We all played against each other, rivals, and now all of our fans are coming together to cheer on one team. So it's definitely been a blessing to work with all these girls that I've always been against and work as a team and build. It was hard at first because all of us weren't used to each other. But we've definitely built through this years, and then I hope these next couple of years I can be here to support and look there for any advice that they may need and be there for them technically. So, wasn't always an easy road becoming a Nighthawk and making your way to where you are now. There have been challenges along the way, but we've seen a lot of growth this year as well. This team has really come into its own. We've seen a bond between you and your teammates that we've never seen before. You know, you guys are sisters on and off the floor. You play basketball remarkably well on the floor. You know, to, in terms of your sophomore year, as, as you get ready to say goodbye to Nighthawk Nation, tell me maybe one of your favorite memories or your, your favorite moment with these girls this year? Well, the favorite moment would definitely be the Christmas lights when we went to Jackson, Tennessee. That was definitely one of the fun parts of it. Everybody got out of the hotel when they didn't want to. It was cold, but the lights um, were just beautiful, but we all got to sit there and laugh and enjoy and just erase the games, erase everything, and just build our friendship, and it's they're a fun group of girls to be around, so... Yeah, absolutely. Now, you know, a, a lot of athletes out there, a lot of uh, high school athletes out there are looking to play on the next level and looking to give a place like National Park College a try. That's exactly what you did coming right out of high school. What advice would you give to the high school female athlete out there who wants to continue playing basketball but isn't necessarily sure if junior college basketball is right for them? Well... I definitely went off and played Division Three right after high school, and I went away. My parents weren't there just because it was a three-hour drive back and forth, and it's hard. It's really hard. With the Hot Springs, it's kind of a tight community. Believe it or not, I didn't think that whenever I came out here, nobody else would cheer for me just because there's a bunch of everybody else coming. But this community is a great place to be around, and the, the faculty, all the fans, all the girls are just super sweet, and so it's, it's worth it. If you want to stay in your hometown and they're giving you that opportunity to stay here, use that two years to build, and you can go play afterwards. I mean, our coaches, they will get you where you want to go. Just let them know and work for it. So I would definitely recommend it. It's, it's been a blast. Bailey, let's talk about today's game a little bit. On the road at Rama, Oklahoma is a place where your team's had some success this year. You're looking to go back out there, get another W. How do you and your group of girls get it done today? Well, we're definitely working on our shooting percentage. We need to make sure that we hit better than we were. We were playing at our away team's gyms, and we were hitting 60% of our shots. And then here, we're, we were declining. But we got to get Haley back to shooting again. She said she's feeling herself, so we're going to let her do her thing. And um, we just got to keep our composure. This team we seem to butt heads with sometimes. So hopefully we'll keep our composure and just not let ourselves get down at the beginning if they were to get a hot streak like they did last game. So I hope it's going to go pretty well today and we'll pull through. Bailey, it's been really awesome getting to watch you play here, watch you grow Nighthawk Nation, really lay the groundwork for what could be something really great for female athletes in Garland County for years to come. Uh, we've really enjoyed watching you on the floor. Thank you thank for, for allowing us to, to cover you. Uh, is there anybody that you would like to say thank you to today? Um, I would like to say thank you to my mom and dad. Um, they've been my number one supporters through everything. Um, definitely for supporting me and thank you for this faculty that's done everything they could to get us our hotels and to kneel with keeping up with us and everything like that. I really appreciate it. She's Bailey Womack of the National Park Nighthawk Women. More on today's game next. This is National Park Nighthawks basketball on xerosports.com.